What's up, this is Danny Garcia. You're now tuned into Linnell Boxing TV with Birdie. Look for that no look left hook. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be good and make millions of dollars without looking. Shit. <laughs> Steve Bird, Linnell Boxing TV at Guildford City Boxing Club. If you could kindly just introduce yourself to the camera. My name is Nancy Shepherd. I'm 14 from Kent Gloves Boxing Club. Uh, three, yeah, three years roughly. I went to a boxing gym and I got really into it. And then my dad bought his own boxing gym and I just trained there since. When I flew out to Ireland, I boxed in front of like thousands of people. That was like the first fight I had. I just roughly turned 10, a few days later, we flew out there and my dad was like, can we have a skills belt? And they was like, no, we, we can get her in for a belt. We took it. Didn't get a decision because I was really nervous. I was really nervous. Well, where I am today, I was not like that at all. I boxed with my hands up. I used to flick my legs out where they used to get tired. I used to be small little plump. I'm really unfit as well. So you've really come on from then? Yeah. Well, it was really good. I loved it. Ever since I got my first ever win, I was buzzing about boxing. 16 and won 11. Southport, it depends what, like, if I have a taller girl, I have boxing my hands up, but if, like, the girl's the same height, smaller, box my hands down. Uh, yeah, I get excited, but I don't really get nervous. Like, I used to just love getting in the ring. I love sparring as well. Well, my friends don't really think, like, I don't look like a boxer, but they think I'm really good. They hope I go further. They're all proud of me. Um, I've got a few girl mates there, but to be honest, yeah, there's quite a few girls there, and I've got loads of boy mates. Yeah. Um, to box like I want to box like Josh Kelly when I'm older. He's my favourite boxer, but I want to world uh, win world titles and box for England when I'm old enough. I won a national title, the minors, when I was 11 or 10. I went to a few of their camps. It was quite good. Yeah. I was nervous, but. I got over it in a few days. Like I was really happy because of where I won. I got so excited, and then my dad was like, "You're going up to eat, like Sheffield Boxing." I'm like, I couldn't believe it. So I got there on like a Thursday. I think it was like a whole weekend thing. So like Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, and then we drove home Saturday, uh, Sunday night. So like, I've lost loads of like confidence. Um, fitness, I've had to build it all up back up again. Through lockdown I was running, like, not training, but training at home. It got, it affected me quite a bit. Not really, but like, since I was like eight, I've loved boxing. Why do you like Josh Kelly so much then? I don't know, he's just my favourite boxer. I like his style, I like the way he moves, his head movement. It's good. Is that what you sort of try and emulate, is it? Do you remember his first fight? Uh, that you watched? Yeah, I went to O2 and watched him. He was watching, I think it was on the same like card as Kel Brook and all that, Katie Taylor. I think it was that one. That was the first ever fight and then I just loved him since. Yeah, I got PGS. Oh, PGS, what does that say? Pretty Girl Shepherd. <laughs> Take off Josh Kelly. <laughs> Ireland, three times. Sweden, um, I, don't, I think that's the only point, like, places I have. Ireland and Sweden, yeah. Uh, well, my, where my dad has the own boxing place. So, so what's your boxing club? It's Ken... Kent Gloves Boxing. Kent Gloves Boxing. Club, yeah. Well, my dad has his page, like, we share an account, me, my brother and him, so like, yeah. we can post videos and all that of ourselves. 
World title. World title. <laughs> right. I'll only be 24, but I want to go pro anyway. Can't wait. And I want to be like Dennis McCann. He's good. He's brilliant. Josh Kelly, Dennis McCann. Any others? Um, Katie Taylor. Yeah. I don't mind her. Yeah, that's it. Perfect. Well, that's a good little prediction. We'll come back in 10 years and have a look. <laughs> Anyone you want to thank? Anyone that helps uh, you out? Or? I want to thank my dad for getting me here, <laughs> making me spar, <laughs> making me become a boxer, and all my coaches at my gym. There's uh, a lot of time and effort that goes in behind the scenes, isn't there? Yeah. So. No, brilliant. Okay, we'll watch this space. <laughs> Lovely. Thanks for your chat.